What is going on? Welcome back to Projects with Matt. In today's video, we're gonna be installing an hour meter on my Honda HRN 216. First thing you're gonna need is the hour meter itself, right? I bought a four pack on Amazon for about 15 bucks. I'll put a link down below in the description. It comes with this induction wire which wraps around the spark plug cable and comes back to the hour meter. You have some screws, screwdriver. I have a way to mark the point where I'm gonna install it. Some cutters to cut the wire and a zip tie to hold everything in place. Pretty simple, should be an easy install. First thing we have to do on this mower is remove this screw right here. This screw holds in a little clip that holds in four tabs around the, this red cover on the mower. So you can see they're all, I can't, can't tell if you can see on the camera, but they're all, all the tabs are marked by this little indent. So you can come around, pop them out once you've taken that screw out, feel around from on the other side. You do need to unscrew the gas cap, all right? and our cover just slides off. The reason I'm taking the cover off is because I'm gonna run a wire from this spark plug wire here through the casing and I mount that hour meter right here on the side next to where that uh, the gas shut off valve is. All right, so your next step is to take your, your wire and wrap it around your spark plug wire. The instruction says around five times, so we're going to take what the instructions say, and we're going to wrap around five times. So I'm going to take enough length to wrap it around. That's once. That's twice. That's three times. That's four times. And here is the fifth time. All right. What we're going to do is we're going to take that zip tie and attach these, these two little leads together so that it holds it in place and it holds it nice and tight. All right. So we're going to just snug that up. All right. So that's in place. Doesn't look like it's gonna come off. Zip ties being held in. All right. Next thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna just trim up my zip tie. Next, we're gonna do our best to kind of guide where this wire needs to go and where we're gonna mount the hour meter on this red casing. So I'm gonna kind of place the casing right back into place, but not snap it into place. Kind of take the wire, loosely tease it around underneath, and kind of get it to the point and where I'm gonna mount it. All right. Next, the way this works is the wire only just sits in this little groove here, right? So what we're gonna to have to do is make sure that this hour meter can still have the wire coming into it, All right? So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna mark out where this wire needs to come, just using my fingers, and we're gonna take that wire and we're gonna push it in to that groove. I'm gonna take my screwdriver, flathead would probably be better, and push that wire into place. You know what? I'm even going to try using the back of the zip tie since it's flat. Much better. All right, so that gets that into place. All right, and right about here is where I'm going to mount it. So next step is I'm gonna gra grab my little pokey tool and mark 
where I want this to go. There's one. There's two. Next step, I'm going to take my screw, plop it into the hole, and screw it into place. Let's get the second screw lined up and get the second screw installed. All right, both screws are installed. Just put my finger back there to see if it's poking into anything. Next step, we're going to trim the excess wire. So I'm just going to come here, take a little snip. And now we can fully resecure this housing back onto the mower. I have it lined up pretty well. Just going to push down, snap it into place all around. And we can install this clip back on. Not backwards though. The process would be exactly the same for any other device or a small engine you're going to put an hour meter onto. Basically the cable wraps around the spark plug wire, wire runs into this little groove, you mount the little hour meter, and it should function. All right. So we've got the hour meter installed. It's a little bit breezy outside. It's pretty chilly, but let's get this started. I'll show you how it works. Make sure it works too. When the hour meter is recording, you can see the hourglass on the left-hand side flashes. It takes six minutes for it to go to 0.1. All right, and that's a wrap on how to install an hour meter. I today installed it on my Honda HRN 216. But this can be applicable to any mower out there on the market. Thanks for watching. Please like, comment, and subscribe. See you in the next one.